Okay, let's do this next um, problem in the lecture notes, a little more challenging than the last one. It says, silver has um, a total of two isotopes. One isotope contains 60 neutron, neutrons and has a percent abundance of 51.839%. The other contains 62 neutrons. So, we'll say isotope one, um, the number of neutrons, it contains, so we'll just say silver 1, silver 2, um, what was it, 60 and 62 it said. And then the percent abundance was 51.839% of the one with 60 neutrons. Um, then it asks, okay, so since you have that information, what are the mass numbers and symbols of each of these isotopes? So the mass numbers of each of these isotopes. Um, you need to get your calculator out to do this problem. Well, you could probably do it in your head. Um, the first thing you have to remember is, well, it didn't give you the uh, elemental symbol for silver, so you got to remember that silver is AG, it's one of those weird ones. Um, the mass number, so if you find AG on the periodic table, so look for it on the periodic table, and when you do, you'll see that it's number 47. So that's the number of protons it has. So remember, to be a silver atom, you have to have 47 protons. So that one's got 47, and that one's got 47. So the mass number, remember capital A sometimes is used for mass number, is going to be 60 plus 47, I guess you don't need your calculator for that one, 107 um, Daltons or whatever. And the bottom one, uh, silver 2, the second isomer of silver or isotope of silver, is going to be 62 plus 47, which is... 109 Dalton. So that's the mass number of those two. So then it wants you to write the elemental symbol for them, so you can now. So the first one is going to be AG. Remember, subscript is the atomic number, which is the same as the number of protons, 47. And the superscript is the 107. So that's the first silver. And then the uh, atomic symbol for the second one, the second um, isotope is going to be 109 at the top there and 47 at the bottom. Okay? And then it says, um, the second question I believe it said was, what was the percent abundance of the other isotopes? So this is what we're looking for. So we know that the total abundance is going to be 100.000 percent. Okay, so if there's only these two, you just take a hundred and subtract it from, or subtract 51.839 from it, and you get 48.161 percent. So that's the percent abundance of uh, silver 109. So hopefully that answers that question.